Having trouble with your Wi-Fi? Forgotten your router's password? Sometimes, the best solution is a fresh start. In this video, we'll show you how to safely perform a factory reset on your TP-Link WR820N router. This will erase all your custom settings and restore it to its original out-of-the-box date. Let's get started. Step 1. Locating the Reset Button Now, let's find the Reset Button. On the TP-Link WR820N, it's a small reset button beside Ethernet port. Step 2. The Reset Process Make sure the router is powered on. The lights should be on. Now press Reset button for 10 seconds, and you'll see the lights on the router flash or blink. This is the sign that the reset process has begun. Router will reboot and take about 2 to 3 minutes to restore default settings. Once the router has fully rebooted, the factory reset is complete. Your router is now back to its original settings. Check router default Wi-Fi name should start broadcasting. This means your Wi-Fi network name and password have been reset to the defaults. You can find these on the sticker on the bottom or back of the router. Connect to that Wi-Fi network. Login router using default IP 192.168.0.1 and set up again. Method 2. Reset from web interface. First connect your TP-Link router using Wi-Fi or wired. Access default IP address 192.168.0.1 and use admin password for login. Now go to advanced tab from top menu. Then go to system option from left side menu. Under system, go to backup and restore. Scroll page and find factory restore button. You will get final confirmation. All current settings will be lost. Press restore button to confirm reset. Router will reboot and restore to default mode. After reset complete, you need to set up router again. That's it. You have successfully reset your TP-Link TL WR820 Wi-Fi router. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe channel. Thanks for watching.